Welcome back Pokefans to the Pokemon Eon Guardians playthrough so last episode we made our way back to Topus Oasis which is where we are now we got our fifth gym badge which was actually harder than it probably should have been but we did get it in the end it was the fire um, gym leader Flint I think his name was after that there was a cry for help in the north east of the Oasis so that's what we're going to do today and hopefully start making our way to the next town or city which is Slateburg. So if we head on up here, oh I don't think I remember you being here. This, these people, they suddenly stormed into the lab. I have no idea what these people want from us but there are some dangerous substances in the lab. Besides they took my colleague hostage, someone has to do something. Please you have to help us. Okay, so I think this was the Pokerus lab. But we couldn't get in here. What the hell is a kid doing in here? So it looks like it's Team Gaia. Then you got Primate. Okay. Um, let's switch to Masquerade. Get off that Intimidate. Oh my god, Rock Slide. Switch to Gardevoir. Don't think we one shot this. And then let's just go for a psyche. And then a layer on, we can just go Torterra. I think an earthquake's four times effective, if I'm right. I'm sure this is rock steel. Doesn't have sturdy either, so that's great. I'll have to report that to my supervisor. I don't think we've got any potions. No, we haven't, so I'm going to have to run back and heal, but we'll also get some stuff from the Pokemon. That's the wrong place. This should have updated now as well, because we've got our fifth gym badge. Yeah, we can buy high potions. 30 of those. Probably get 20 of these as well. And we can buy Ultra Balls. Ah, oh, yes, and revives. That will do nicely. Spent a big chunk of money there, but still got quite a bit left. The thing is, it's not hard to get money in this game because you can just redo the Colosseum and the Double Battle Institute, so... And you can do them as much as you want. Meaning you get easy money, really. So, which way do we want to go? Oh, okay, this is Team Gaia Grunt. I thought that was an NPC. Just hiding, but maybe not. Okay, let's go for a Fire Punch. Oh, you just live in any toxic. And then you stall. Great. What's next? A hunch crow. Okay, we can go Pachirisu for that. Electro web. Doesn't do that much damage. Uh, let your ball get to crit. Yeah, I don't think we was KO in that otherwise. These people scare me. What are they up to? To intrude here just like that. Who do these guys think they are? Um, we've got plenty of antidotes. Can we read this book? No. Okay, we've got Dubious disc. Get lost, kid. You're not a serious opponent for our boss anyway. Okay, so their boss is here. We haven't battled him yet. Just these grunts. Let's go for a lava flume. What is with toxic in everything? Well, that takes up to level 40. And Miss Magus, we can go to Drapion. 
and let's just night slash. We should take that shadow ball comfortably. Yep. Does live there. And then your magical leaf, which we also resist. Allies are so, stro so strong. Their Pokemon have been able to evolve without the help of items. That is true strength. Yeah, you keep spouting that nonsense. Okay, um, get rid of the poison again. I'm supposed to watch the hostages here, so leave me alone. Heck. I still don't understand what this peck is. I've never heard that before in my life. Right, here's Gramble. Okay, it hasn't got um, Intimidate. Trade of Paralysis for a burn. Goal bat. Uh, okay, let's go catch a Risu. I've come to the conclusion that the only time that I'll put the light ball on this is probably the Elite Four. Because I just don't seem to ever put it on. I just want to get all the items that Pickup gets. Uh, Skun Tank, we'll go Torterra. We're gonna eat a poison gel probably. Oh no, that's a Night Slash. Takes up to 42 once learnt Iron Head. You know, we're just gonna get rid of Leech Seed. Just because you won doesn't mean I'm gonna release anyone here. Okay, um, that's not what I wanted. Looks like I'm gonna have to use a full heal wing, got my paralyzed heals. Can use soup potion as well. And I'm assuming we've got a good. Uh, there's the boss. So, how do we get in there? No, I'm not gonna tell you what we're here for. Toxic road. <clears throat> so we'll switch. Let's hope it doesn't go for a rock slide. Okay, we went for a drain punch. Air slash. Does just KO. Um, Sneasel. Does Mac punch KO this? I mean, it is four times effective. Yeah, it does. And then probably go Torterra. I think this is just normal type. Oh, it's gone for charm. I don't know how that thing could charm you. It absolutely ate that earthquake. Okay, we'll go Guard of War. Psychic. Thank God that doesn't have no special attack. And how can it use assist when the Pokemon's fainted? I thought they had to be alive to use assist. That's interesting. Can we read any of this? No. You sure don't bother the boss. The boss holds negotiation talks with the research in the front. Stay out of it. Okay, it's so a double battle. Cloister's going to be a bit of a problem. And Thunder Punch. And Bug Bite Mighty Enna. Which absolutely tanks. Okay, so just the same again, I think. Okay, you switch. Interesting. Okay, fire punch the bonnet. Oh, actually, no, no, no. 
change that, change that. Right, switch you into hatchery suit and then bug by no night slash Bennett. Those spikes hurt quite a bit. Okay, Bennett's gone. Back out comes Cloyster. Right, we'll go for Electro Web. Take a turn to heal Pachirisu. Toxic spikes as well, now. Okay, another Electro Web. And heal up you. Need to pivot into Masquerade and then back to Drapion to get rid of that uh, Toxic Spy. This is a little bit of a challenge of metal. Um, discharge. See, I don't like it because it basically hits my own Pokemon. Now we'll, we'll leave it for now. Out comes Ariados. Okay, Electro Web. Switch to Masquerade. That gets off a good Intimidate. Arido somehow misses it. Okay, needs to take a turn to heal you. Well, actually, no, I don't, no, I don't. I can just switch to Drapion. And then go for an air slash on Ariados. Ooh, so close to that KO. That Ariados likes that spray, doesn't it? Um, let's go for struggle bug. Close. Okay, now we can just KO. Out comes Mighty Enna, which to be fair is just going to get taken out anyway. And there you go, we've done it. That was like a little mini boss battle. The boss will teach you manners. See if Child Like You would understand our ideals. Team who? What kind of weirdos are they? The switch for the security door. You can simply deactivate it via the PC. Should we have done that already? You probably should have actually. You'd have probably saved me all this hassle. Right then. Run back and heal and then we'll come back and take on the boss. Okay then, so. Another double battle it is. How could you possibly get through to the security computer? Who do you think you are just meddling in the lofty affairs of Team Gaia? Oh, they've only got two Pokemon and they've got a Pokemon that has Levitate. Fantastic. Okay, I think I Icy Wind and just Earthquake anyway. Just for Shadow Ball of all things. Should have struggle bugged actually because I'm sure Gwampig's um, psychic type. Yep. Bye bye Gwampig. Get hit with a toxic. Okay, now we can air slash and iron head. Not too bad, not too bad. I understand now why my colleagues had problems. Again, getting rid of per um, poison. And then let's battle you then. Now don't be stupid and cooperate with us, nothing will happen to you. But what you're asking is insane. 
This mutated virus could cost the lives of thousands of people and Pokemon. The normal Pokerus virus enhances the Pokemon's cell growth and does not otherwise affect the Pokemon's health. But the mutant variant we are exploring here is a much more extreme variant of the same virus. Some Pokemon will become stronger but not all will survive the side effects of this virus. Do you think I don't know all this? But exactly for this reason we've paid you this little visit here. The supreme law of nature is evolution, survival of the fittest. We humans have undermined this nature with our delusion of wanting to play God. The result of this is that there are now far too many weak and sick creatures in the world. And we at Team Guy want to put an end to this blasphemy. Once we release the virus you have obtained, all the weak creatures will disappear and only the strong and healthy Pokemon and humans will remain. So that the world is as it should be. You are crazy. No, not at all. We only have the courage to do what needs to be done. Look. Child from Granite Deep Sea. So you managed to defeat my subordinates. Outstanding. You want me to leave these people alone? These people don't interest me at all. We just want the virus to research in here. Anyway, I don't have time to waste for you. If you want to stop us, you'll just have to deal with the consequences. Okay then. His name's Selecto. Ah, oh, Shiftry's perfect lead. Struggle bug. Four times super effective. Um, Golem. Yeah, we go to Torterra. We pretty much eat whatever move it's got. And it's Razor Leaf. Guess stronger than the first four. One more Razor Leaf. Get quick. Come on. Oh, maybe not. Then it just self destructs. I hate that thing. You'll get interfering in our affairs. Let's go Pachirisu. Ooh, that was a good switch. Electro Web. Doesn't actually do much. Crunch does a lot. Okay, let's go for a charm. Okay, now we can fully heal, and then we can bring Torterra back as well. Where's the revives? We're literally just asking for a crit here. How have you got through paralysis and confusion? Okay, you hit yourself this time. Electro Ball doesn't finish up because you go for Aqua Jet. Right, how do this thing was a problem before? Just stay in. Electro with and then nozzle as well, just to be on the safe side. And then I want to go to Torterra, which I think now outspeeds Earthquake. Bye bye, Houndu. Metagross, to be honest, I think I think we leave a hit off this. Okay, you've gone for iron defense, that's interesting. Mr. Zen headbutt though. Oh, that berry. And as soon as you want to full restore, two can play that game. Oh, you just switched. And you miss your attack. You've pretty much just thrown the battle. In fact, I'm gonna go Magma. Finish off Metagross. I can't let you ruin our plans. Fire Punch finishes it. 
Not bad, not bad. You seem a lot stronger than you look. Hmm. I'd be lying if I said I expected this outcome of our battle. You seem to be a very strong Pokemon trainer with an equally strong Pokemon team. You would hardly be harmed by the outbreak of this virus. Why are you so committed to these weaklings? I don't get it. Boss, we recovered this item from their archaeology department that you requested. Excellent good work. Looks like our visit here wasn't a complete waste of time after all. Now I guess it's all up to our plan B. What did you steal from our archaeology department? These are partly very rare items. You can't do that. Interesting looks to me like we've already done it. Besides, your mind is too limited anyway to be able to comprehend the true utility of this item. It's a much better off of us. And now for you. You won, that's pretty impressive. But do not get used to this feeling. Next time I'll take you out. So just do yourself a favour and never interfere in our affairs again. You saved us. And not only us, this virus would have affected all the terror. Thank you very much. Yeah, this isn't much, but a young Pokemon trainer like you will certainly find it helpful. It's an old tool from our archaeology department, but you're still in good shape. Ah, Smash Hammer. We'll better stop research on this virus and destroy all our results. All this must not fall into the wrong hands as we've now seen. We'll start an inventory to find out what these people have stolen from our archaeology department. <coughs> However, we will not be aware of anything that would pose a risk. So I think we can breathe a sigh of relief for the time being. This team Gaia, they really seem to be a merciless group. You've now made them your enemy. Please take good care of yourself. Okay. So we finally got Rock Smash. Which is good. Because now we've got loads of places to go and see. What um yeah we're gonna go i think to that other part of devil's reef that we saw oh what latios latios looks at you intensely almost feels like it's looking inside you what what was all that about like why is latios just coming and staring us down like that a little bit weird okay um Oh, we've actually got Pokerus. Of course, we would have was in a virus infected lab. Um, yeah. Interesting. So, the part of Devil's Reef that we need to go to, if I remember right, was all the way to the right. So, it's Papa Super Repel. Ah, oh, snap. I didn't think we had a. Um, any battles on here? Okay, let's bubble weave. What's coming out next? Lair on. Okay, Torterra. It'd be ace if like having Pokus meant you were immune to like statuses. So like you couldn't get paralyzed, poisoned, anything. This one's got sturdy as well. Takes itself out though, so it's not too bad. And Hippopotas will stay in and go for a Razor Leaf. It's gonna eat that though. Oh, maybe not. But to be fair, we are 10 levels ahead. Have you seen a Gibble yet? We've got one, mate. What? There's an item here. A Flame Orb? How did we not find this before? I think that area is here. Yeah, here we go. Right, let's use the flashlight. And now we can smash these rocks. Got a King's Rock and a battle. Okay, level 35. Do we care with Bubble Bean? Gonna test it out. Yes, we do. Anna Riff. I'm pretty sure this is weak to water. I think it's just Lily that's not. Healer Swine. Um. 
probably gonna stay in here. And then we can bubble bean. Ooh, that ice fan does a lot. And then Dogtrio. Oh my god, we just live on a sliver. Coming in clutch there. Thank you very much though, would not get out of here. Okay, then see you later, scrum. Okay, then let's head up here. Oh, got an ultra ball. Just seemed too obvious that there was going to be something there. And a blue shard. Got dust stone. Getting loads of items. Still spooky here, don't you think? It is a little bit actually. Right, out comes a magma. Um, we're just gonna bubble beam. Eat a fire punch for breakfast. Um, camera up. I think we KO this. This is four times super effective. Or we don't. Ah, that's bad. Um, okay. Let's go guard all. Magical Leaf is neutral. That's up to level 42. Okay, we've got Dark Pulse. And that's the end of this little area of Devil's Reef. Mm, got quite a few items though. So I think we're going to end the episode there. Because I know we've got to head all the way back through the other part of Devil's Reef. So next episode we'll do that. And hopefully get close to Slateburg City. I'm not too sure how far away it is. But yeah. Thank you everyone for watching. And hope to see you all next time.